Eagle Ford is a hot spot for oil, but over the past few weeks, it's turned into the mothership of UFO sightings. Some people say they have seen things that make them think there is life out there. Eric Gonzalez went to find out what the objects in the sky are really all about. If you've been around Catula, Texas, then you've probably heard the rumors. Many swear it's become ground zero for unidentified flying objects the past few weeks. Several videos have been posted on YouTube showing sightings in the Catula area. This UFO was posted this past Wednesday. Recently, an awful lot of triangle sightings. That seems to be the big one these days. John Cross of MUFON, the Mutual UFO Network, is a national organization that investigates unidentified flying objects. So what have people seen the most? Probably the fireballs. We're not real sure what those are. We think they've switched over to jet-powered drones. Recently, they investigated this photo that was taken near Catula in an oil field area. There's a lot, lot being made of that photo. Uh, honestly, to us, it looks like a timeline of possibly a vehicle going by um, with a blinker on. MUFON says they can solve 80 to 90 percent of the cases they follow, but it's those unsolved 10 percent cases that excite them. It was at night and it was little things jumping around up there. So, yeah, I guess I do believe in them now. MUFON says California, Texas, and Detroit, Michigan are the hot spots for sightings right now, but they say this UFO is a clear cut case of an airplane or a drone. It really doesn't display any unusual flight patterns of any kind. And as you watch the video toward the end, you, you can clearly see all three of the beacons on the aircraft. Locals say with no trees and a lot of flat ground, the sky's the limit when it comes to UFOs. You can see a long distance out here, you know, at night when you're riding up and down 35. Eric Gonzalez, Ken's 5 I want to